this is Amanda from Home Designs by Amanda, and for the next few vid videos, I'm going to be doing a balloon theme. We're going to be using the Lift Me Up stamp set from the Occasions catalog, which is on page 10 of of that cat of this catalog, the Occasions one. And look at these cute little cards that they have for examples. I don't have any cards done yet, but I have a few ideas for um, some projects to use with with the stamp set and the die set. And the die set is the up and away thin lip dies. And those you can bundle and save 10% if you get the bundle of the stamps and the the die the dies for your big shot. So and then you'll see here that we have paper the designer series paper that matches the lift me up bundle that we have here and it is adorable I love all the balloons and then the the farm scenes and these ones are some of my favorites here the the town with the tractor and the deer and so I just really like that one and then the, the mountain scene here with the the hot air balloons above it just really like that and then the the mint macaron I just love that color here with the, the hot air balloons and clouds and it's just a simple nice subtle and then this is the the double sided paper so you're nice nice choices and you get two of each in that and this is available in the celebration catalog which is good until March 31st and that you can get it's on page 7 that you can get if you spend $50 you can get it for free so every $50 you get to pick an item out of the celebration catalog that's a really good deal I like that and these are really cute papers but we'll get our back first to project we're going to work on that has that we're going to use with the the stamp set and the thinlet dies I used this one is the bigger stamp and the bigger or the medium sized die there and that is on just some cardstock that I have these are party favors that are stuffed with candy and they are going to be like disposable so I did not <laughs> I did not use um, stampin' up paper with them. I used some paper that I had, some scrapbook paper. This is a 12 by 12 pieces of scrapbook paper that I cut down, and 12 by 12 pieces of cardstock that I also cut down to use with with these, because they're party papers. They're going to be thrown away. So I just used some stuff I had on hand. So the first thing I did is I took my my scrapbook paper, my 12 by 12 scrapbook paper and cut it down to 4 by 6 and then I took my snail adhesive which I thought for sure it was going to hold but I do have a few that are popping open I think this one I did last night I think it's staying together maybe once it's all like tied they'll stay better I'm not sure why some of them are popping open. Maybe it's the car, or maybe it's the paper. I don't know. I'll have to see. I thought for sure that this would hold it. But what I was doing was just going down the short edge and the long edge. I fold short edge to short edge and just line that up. And, create, and it just pushed it down and then you just take I tried to make it the seam a little off center and I just pushed that down onto the adhesive as well and then you take the other end and go the opposite direction for your folding and just kind of push that together and there you have your treat bat, your treat box, treat thing. So then you just open it up here, 
stuff it with whatever candies you want to put in there. And then take, so I forgot to grab this, but a hole punch. And I was just punching a hole so far apart. Taking a little bit of thread. It's a thicker thread, I think. It's, a, it's an upholstery thread. The bigger and the smaller balloons. And I also did this cloud here. So I took those and got those all stamped. I stamped the on the light blue cardstock I stamped Night of Navy. And on the light green cardstock I used Mint Macaron. And then on the the clouds I used Tempting Topaz, I believe. I believe that's what it was. No, Tempting Turquoise. Right, Tempting Turquoise. Turquoise is a purple, I think. I don't know. Tempting turquoise. Okay. And then I I stamped them and die cut them with with their coordinating dies here and have them all cut out in the cloud one there too. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have a big either a bigger balloon on it, or I'm gonna take one of the smaller balloons, which is the green. I'm gonna take a smaller balloon and a cloud, and I'm going to put them on with some, I have some foam tape here I'm going to use. Same thing as stamping dimensionals, but I have those put away. So I'm going to use some, some foam tape on the back here. And I think I'm going to just tear it all, put that in front of the cloud. And just stick it all right on the front of my gift bag. Favors for the party. And then later I'll be doing a decor decoration using this detailed thinlet die. So hope you'll come back to see that later. Any of this stuff will be listed on the corresponding blog post if you want to see what I use to make these. You enjoyed coming and creating with me today. Thank you! Mm -hmm.